The St. Gates and Nevis Patriots have spent the past few hours regrouping, strategizing and sharpening their skills all in a big push to ensure victory in their next match coming up Wednesday night, 4th September at the Warner Park Cricket Stadium when SKN Patriots come up against the Guyana Amazon Warriors. Speaking at the press conference hosted by the Patriots, 3rd September at the St. Kitts Marriott Resort, head coach Malolan Rangarajan and captain Andre Fletcher sought to assure fans and supporters that the St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots are aiming for much better performances going forward in the 2024 edition of the Republic Bank Caribbean Premier League. Coach Rangarajan indicated that much preparation has gone into all the components of preparing a team for high-end tournaments. Uh, whenever we plan for a batter pre-game, to me it's always uh, not a very unilateral approach. We have a data analyst with our team who gives us insights from data. Then we have coaches who with their experience give their input. We have players who may may or may not have played with that player. We get inputs from there. That's where we get the psychological bit from. And then with the coaches, like I said, they give the te technical inferences. So we have those. We triangulate the data we have, which is then given to the players to understand that these are specifics of how we can make the batter struggle, etc., cetera, etc. Cetera. That's before the game. Once we start playing the game, you know, cricket is. One, that's why they call it a game of uncertainties. You can't prescribe exactly what's going to happen, how it's going to happen. A batter might decide to have a different psyche for a particular day. It's important as we have very experienced people on the field to understand the psyche of the batter. And I think whatever Fletcher has done as skipper till now, and I've mentioned it to our team also, the bowling changes have been spot on, even though we've been going for runs, the chances that have been created every time we bring in a bowler. We've almost had a chance created almost every over post the seventh. In the last game, we know what happened in the power play. So that, give, that gives me as head coach an indication that, you know, we're gauging the game properly. The positives, like I said, are in the details. So this, this is a positive that is in the detail. For team captain Andrew Fletcher, the time is now for every player to bring his best execution of skills in the remaining games starting with this match coming up against the Amazon Warriors. Um, the response that the, the guys um, had after the last game, um, we had a, a team discussion and um, or should I say players only discussion and we came up with some interesting you know, ideas and, and we um, ways moving forward. So it's just for us to regroup as a team. Um, you know, we don't want to ponder too much on, on, on the, the losses, the two losses. Um, we had some positives, especially where the batting is concerned. And as the coach mentioned, it's, um, it's evident. It's our fielding that has been, you know, putting us under some pressure. So it's just for us to regroup. As I said to the guys, we have to look at ourselves in the mirror and you know, take it up on our own to, to, to whatsoever it takes to get us over that line. Um, we have to do it. We don't have a choice. We, we're playing for our franchise. We're playing for the people of St. Kitts and Nevis. We're playing for even the fans, supporters in the diaspora. So we, we, we are professionals. We, we get paid to play this sport and we have to show them the reason why we are here and to keep and put a smile on the, on the people's face. So at Warner Park this Wednesday night, the St. Kitts and Nevis Patriots will be looking for stronger support from the spectators and the team will be working hard to deliver a victory. Glenn Bart reporting for SK Newsline.